Stanley Mchome is from Magugu, an area of northern Tanzania famous for its aromatic rice. Like most farmers, much of his time is spent working in the fields. But Stanley has a secret life. He's at Mkulima Shushushu. Mkulima Shushushu is a spy, marketing spy. Stanley works undercover, investigating market prices, always on the lookout for new trends and business opportunities. This work is difficult. Many traders does not want farmers to know the actual price. Therefore, you must be careful when you do this job. Like every self-respecting spy, Stanley relies on gadgets. And fortunately for him, modern communication technology is rapidly expanding throughout East Africa. He uses SMS to send today's market prices back to fellow farmers in Magugu, which will give them the upper hand when negotiating with traders. Encouraging networks of farmers to use modern communications to improve their marketing is all part of the First Mile project, a collaboration between the Tanzanian government and IFAD, the UN's rural poverty specialists. First Mile it has helped us a lot to omit this middlemen. For middlemen are getting a lot of pro profit. And it seems to be working. In the case of Mugugu, profits have doubled since their first harvest attracting business offers from Dodoma Transport Company, one of the biggest firms in the country. But Magugu's success is not only a product of Stanley's high-tech marketing intelligence, it's also due to the application of state-of-the-art economic theory, in this case, value chains. We tried to arrange our chain of producers, processors, traders and consumer. We tried to stay together and talk so that each one benefit. Once producers understand the market chain they're in and who the players are and they can meet them and talk to them, all sorts of new ideas come up. Recently, Stanley discovered that consumers were buying Magugu rice at twice the price under a different brand name. Now his investigation could help his group negotiate a more fair trade for their product. They are now exploring how to, to patent their rice. To sell our rice in our trademark, Magugu Super Rice. When they eventually do sit around the table, they will be considerably more empowered, especially if they have some, some patent legislation in their back pockets. Across Tanzania, hundreds of similar groups are now sending out their own Makalima shushushus into the marketplace, proving the old adage, knowledge is power.